Hey Booktube, my name's Becca and welcome to Booktubeathon Day 3. I'm so excited for this day. The challenge is just going to be spectacular, but before I get through that, I want to talk about what I read yesterday. Um, I set out to read both manga I had on my list, but however, I only read one. I read the second one and um, because I got busy and I just kind of started watching Hulu and Netflix and playing League and YouTube and yeah, that's what happened. And I caught po I went out and caught Pokemon for like two hours. I did that too. So I only read one of these. I think I'm going to save number two and three until Friday or Saturday because I work long shifts both of those days. So it'll be very easy for me to read a manga one of those days. But yeah, this was great and amazing and it was pretty much as good as the first one. I just, I need more. I need to read the next one. So I am so excited for this challenge today. If you do not know what it is, um, the challenge for today is the book titan challenge i don't know the name of it but it's like basically you make a short script or monologue that's around a minute and you throw in as many book titles as you can and make sure it kind of makes a little bit of sense so i after the video was posted last night i i stayed up and made a script for like an hour and then i've been editing it a lot this morning so i am so excited to do this so have fun watching my channel you might notice my bookshelves are a bit bare and that's because I've taken books out to do this challenge. So without further ado, let's get into the challenge for today. I'm going to tell you a story. Across the universe, there is an empire, an empire of storms. In the empire, there are six cities, the city of bones, of ashes, of glass, of fallen angels, of lost souls, and of heavenly fire. It is in the last one that the court of thorns and roses resided. It was ruled by the queen of shadows who sat upon the throne of glass and her daughter, the heir of fire, who donned the crown of midnight and wielded the assassin's blade. The heir had four apprentices, the legendary Max, the prodigy known as Fang, the champion angel, and the eldest Cinder. However, there was a new prophecy that at midnight the empire would become a falling kingdom, and this is precisely what happened. Fueled by their recent fractured friendship and her hunger for power, the fourth apprentice betrayed the empire, allowing the clockwork prince, Prince Caspian from the neighboring kingdom Deathly Hollow, to rush in and throw the empire into chaos. By dawn, the once prosperous empire was never more. The end. Hey Booktube, it's me again. I'm exhausted. Um, I hope you enjoyed my little monologue story thing I don't even know what it was but I that took forever to do because I filmed three different ways of doing it I filmed just me reading it and showing up the books I filmed my pops which is the version you saw and I also filmed me acting out each part which was very difficult because I was putting on jackets in the middle of July um and then I spent all afternoon editing and um my editing adventures were so much fun. I normally use Windows Movie Maker, but it was giving me a lot of problems with the voice overlays, so um, I switched to Sony Vegas. But Sony Vegas has problems with Windows Movie Maker files, so it kept freezing and um, doing stupid stuff. And then I finally got it to work, and it was working beautifully, and I had most of it. I had about over half of it edited. And then my computer completely restarts on me for no reason at all. And I cried and yelled at my laptop. I had to re-edit stuff and I am so done with this video. I'm glad at how it came out, but I am just so freaking done with it. I'm glad it's done. Hope you enjoyed and good luck on your challenge and see you tomorrow. Bye.